stressed? Don't feel like a Batman anymore. Even he was stressed. He had to save Gotham, for God's sake. Hustling to meet the deadline, scrambling to wrap up that presentation, sweating up a storm while you watch your precious stock tank. Stress ensures it makes its presence felt in so many different ways. It might have a bad street rep, but it ain't always the bad guy. Stress in bouts is manageable. It increases your alertness and performance. It also pushes you outside your comfort zone, pushing you to get over the line. Stress becomes chronic when it overstays its welcome. Like that toxic, annoying ex who refuses to leave. And that's when the problems begin, because it causes both mental and physical reactions. When your brain senses stress, it activates your autonomic nervous system, alerting your entire body. It switches on your fight or flight mode. Adrenal glands release the stress hormones cortisol, adrenaline, and norepinephrine. And as these three hormone hombres enter your bloodstream, they stress your blood vessels and your heart. Kinda inception of stress here, for the lack of a better analogy. Adrenaline, along with norepinephrine, makes the heart beat faster, raising your blood pressure over time, causing hypertension. Yeah, not good news. On the other hand, cortisol can cause improper functioning of the inner lining of blood vessels. Now, you know that's bad news. Here's the worst bit. This can cause cholesterol plaque buildup over time and increase your risk towards a stroke or heart attack. A common coping mechanism our bodies have developed over time is asking for comfort food. You know, that carb-rich processed food. While this might feel good for a while, uh, duh. Chronic stress can disrupt the natural rhythmic contractions and cause a lot of acid buildup and sensitivity in the stomach, causing heartburn. And we don't want that. Chronic stress can also change your gut bacterial composition, causing digestive disorders in the body. Cortisol is responsible for making you crave carb-rich foods, causing your metabolic health to decline and for those love handles to look prominent. High levels of cortisol also contributes towards those extra calories as visceral fat around all your organs. This changes the signaling system in the body and the brain, causing mass production hormones and immune system chemicals called cytokine, which can cause inflammation and insulin resistance. If chronic stress is not managed effectively and in time, it can lead to metabolic diseases and shorten your lifespan. And life's too short for sugar-free Sundays. So the million dollar question is, do we have a way around this? Because we love fries and eating with your eyes isn't possible. We need to accept that there are multiple stressors all around us and we need to face them every day. But learning to manage your response to stress can change the way your brain and body perceive stress, which then positively impacts your overall metabolic health.